Shalom. Ko halal Yahweh, Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, Ba Hashem Rakakodash. Double honest to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who taught me this truth and rule well. Salutation and salutations to the brothers out there that are laboring and pushing this truth in truth and in sincerity and in charity, risking their lives and their freedom to do so. To you I say Shalom, to the Akim and to the Akwaf, that'll be brothers and sisters, Adawan Ratazah, that is to say, Lord willing. Hopefully, by the end of this lesson, you'll be edified. This is your brother Amawan Ibad from the GMS Miami camp. Back again with another lesson to the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, to feed the lambs of Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, as commanded. And today's lesson is going to be entitled Unrighteous Decrees. Okay, once again, today's lesson is going to be entitled Unrighteous Decrees. And um, this lesson was sparked or inspired by an article I was just reading that I found on the People's, the People's Voice. Okay, the People's Voice uh, is a website. Um, you can find it online. Okay, but um, let me put up a quick disclaimer. Okay, uh, Fair Use, the Copyright Act of 1976 under Section 107, which gives way for commentary, criticism, and things of that nature. So this lesson that I'm doing is not for uh, monetary gain, all right? Uh, anything of that sort. This is just for educational purposes. So uh, I don't. I do not own this article. I'm just reading it. All right. So my disclaimer would be the Fair Use Act. But as you can see on your screen, it is, it is, it is entitled "California Approves." Okay, Gil Snakes. As you, as you can see, his name is up there. Gil Snakes plan to make residents drink their own feces. Okay. California approves gill snakes plan to make residents drink their own feces. Okay. Now, this article is dated today, December the 20th, 2003. Okay. And um, <laughs> this is an unrighteous decree, man. All right. California approves. All right. A plan. And whose plan it is? This guy that appears everywhere, man. He, he's appearing everywhere in the world with his tentacles, man. All right? California approves gill snakes plan to make residents drink their own feces. Okay? So let's get a little bit into the article. Before we get into the article, let's, let's read a scripture real quick so we can interject some scriptures. All right? This is Isaiah, the 10th chapter and the first verse. It says, Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees this is that's an that's an unrighteous decree man okay that's very much an unrighteous decree okay they approve this plan to make residents drink their own feces man come on man this this come on man. horrible man all right uh isaiah chapter 10 and verse 1 woe to them that decree unrighteous decrees and that right grievousness which they have prescribed nobody elected you man all right but these are things that they have prescribed, you know, polluting the world, man. Um, let's read a little bit of the article. It says, California lawmakers have approved a new bill, a new, <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's just say, yeah, you see the name up there. California lawmakers have approved a new bill. <laughs> to force residents to drink their own feces by dumping sewage back into the drinking water supply. You see? Come on, man. That's horrible, man. Okay? Reading on, it says, the California State Water Resources Control Board voted to approve regulations that would streamline direct portable reuse. Direct DPR, direct portable reuse. So that's the acronym for, for direct portable. Direct portable reuse. Wow. Mm. DPR. <laughs> A method by which purified waste water, not purified water, purified, right? Waste water is released right into a public water system or just upstream from a treatment plant. The Hill reports. Hey man, remember the indigenous, the indigenous people, man, which is the northern uh, 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 kingdom, man, those northern tribes. 
when they first got to the Americas, man, they, they you, you could drink the water pure right out of the rivers, man. The fountains, the rivers, you know. The way things is right now, <laughs> all the all the course of the earth uh, uh, is, 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 is the earth is, is off course, man. The scriptures tell you. You know, the scripture speaks about destroying them which destroy the earth, man. Okay. This is the reason why, man, because these unrighteous decrees. Are you going to put uh, uh, purified wastewater, wastewater into the in, into the uh, the water system, man? Come on, man, that's horrible. It says, it says, uh, California approves treated potty water, <laughs> treated potty water for drinking water. Wow, California approves. Treated party water for drinking water. 21st century Green Hill. Here we come. Steve Malloy wrote on X, which is the uh, which is which is which is uh, which uh, which was was Twitter is now X. Okay, and this is this is horrible. Man. Let's get let's get the next scripture. Let's get um. What's that, Micah? The book of Micah, Micah the second chapter, right? Uh, this is the book of Micah chapter two, verse one. It says, woe to them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is in the power of their hand. It's in the power of those of people have, man. Nobody, unelected officials, because it says, that was this guy plan, man, okay? Uh, uh, Gil, all right, Gil snakes, man, all right. You see, that's an un that's an unrighteous decree, man. Woe to them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is in the power of their hand. You see, they got the power to do these things, and look what they're doing with the power they have, man. You see, let's go back to the article and read a little more. It says. We've been working on these regulations for over 10 years now, making sure that it's absolutely pre uh, protective of public health. Darren Polhemus, Deputy Director of Board's Division of Drinking Water, said at the Tuesday hearing, this will also hardly be the first instance of repurposing sewage in California. Repurse repurposing sewage in California. Wow. Utilities in the Golden State around the country have long practiced indirect portable reuse. Portable reuse. The injection of treated wastewater. The point is wastewater. The injection of treated wastewater into environmental buffers such as groundwater, aquifers, or lakes before it's discharged into a public system. Unlike, di unlike indirect portable reuse, however, DPR, right? DPR does not use an underground aquifer or any type of environmental storage barrier. See? No storage barrier, all right? It says instead, the process involves either sending purified wastewater directly into a treatment plant, which is horrible, or first blending it with other water sources. So any way you look at it, it's being blended with, if they do it that way, it's being blended with other water sources. If you send it uh, 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 directly into a treatment plant, it's horrible. It says a milder alternative known as raw water augmentation prior to doing so it's unrighteous decree man it says california's new rules would let but not require water agencies take wastewater treat it and then put it right back into the drinking water system california would be the california would be the second state to allow this following colorado the associated press noted so you see um I think the point is being made. I don't think I need to read no more of this article. That's horrible, man. Okay? I think the point is being made. Okay? Uh, a matter of fact, let me just go on and read a little bit more, and I'll probably get a scripture to close. But it says, it's taking regulators more than... Hold on. 
It's taken regulators more than 10 years to develop these rules, a process that included multiple reviews by independent panels of scientists. <laughs> yeah, I guess they're going to say trust the science, right? Really? A state law required the California Water Resources Control Board to approve these regulations by December 31st, a deadline met with just days to spare. The vote was heralded, heralded by some of the state's biggest water agencies, which all have plans to build huge water recycling plants in the coming years. The Metropolitan Water District of Southern California, which serves 19 million people, aims to produce up to 150 million gallons, nearly 570 million liters per day of both direct and indirect recycled water. A project in San Diego is aiming to account for nearly half of the city's water by 2035 really water agencies will need public support to complete these projects which means convincing customers that not only is recycled water safe to drink but it's but it's not icky <laughs> california's new rules require the wastewater be treated for all pathogens and, and and viruses even if the pathogens and viruses aren't in the water that's different from regular water treatment rules, which only require treatment for non-pathogens, said Darren Pulhumus, Deputy Director of Division of Drinking Water for the California Water Resources Control Board. And that's an unrighteous decree, man. In no way should you allow, uh, in no way should you allow them to put uh, wastewater into, into your, your drinking water system, man. Okay, that's pollution, man. You know, you got fluoride in the in the in the water already. Chems trails in the sky eating GMO food. Now you're gonna allow them to put feces in the in the, in the in my, my goodness. Come on now, man. Let's get Micah two and ten. Okay, the book of Micah chapter two and ten. All right, it says, "Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted, and it will destroy you even with the sword destruction, man." All right. You got to be thinking of the kingdom right now. This world is polluted, man. All right? And let's get Revelation chapter 11, verse 18. Revelation chapter 11, verse 18, it says, And the nations were angry, and thy wrath is come, and the time of the, and the, time of the dead, that they should be judged, and that thou shouldest give reward unto thy servants, the prophets, and to the saints, and to them that fear thy name, small and great, and shouldest destroy them which destroy the earth. The, the, the scripture speaks about destroying them that, that, that destroy the earth, man. Okay? The scriptures tell you how all the, the foundation of the course of the earth. It, let's grab that real quick, man. Because these, that's, that's an unrighteous decree, man. Okay? The book of Psalms, Psalms the 82nd chapter and the 5th verse. It says, They know not, neither will they understand. They walk on in darkness all the foundations of the earth are out of course and these are some of the reasons why because these things the things with what, what, what people doing man unrighteous decrees and these kind of stuff man you know changing the ordinances doing things backward putting putting light for darkness and darkness for light you know isaiah 5 and 20 come on man going off but i'm gonna end the lesson there uh point was made lord willing you edified on to the next one shalom